What's up guys? Welcome to uh, Beans' Sick Nasty Mario Jab Lock tutorial. Uh, here to just provide a little visual and insight exactly on how to do the Jab Lock and the benefits of it. Uh, most Marios, when presented with a tech situation, will elect to just use dash attack. Um, it's safe and reliable, it's quick, um, and it's a good punish, but it doesn't really provide too much, uh, aside from distancing yourself from the opponent which isn't great if you want to do a follow-up or if you want to, you know, try and tack on extra damage. Alternatively, what you can do is go for the jab lock setup, which provides more damage um, and in some cases nets you a very early kill. If I can do it. <laughs> there we go. Uh, you can also do things like for spikes. Uh, and obviously these are far superior than your traditional uh, jab lock would be, or not jab lock, your just dash attack option. Uh, the nice thing about this too, um, is when you go for it, even if they tech in place, if you're quick enough, um, they will still get hit by the jab. So even if they decide to tech in place, uh, you'll still be able to input a full jab um, if they stand up, which is a really great get off me option and a really good way to just kind of reset neutral. Uh, so you don't have to worry about being punished for going for jab locks. Um, it should be pretty easy, even if they tech, to just go ahead and input the full jab, and then you don't have to worry about a punish. Uh, the only things you do have to worry about are tech rolls, but depending on what jab lock you're trying to go for, the closer it is, the harder it is to react to. Um, so a lot of people won't be able to react, and if they do, they will only tech in place, which is why a lot of jab locks or the follow-ups to them are pretty successful. Um, so you should not have to worry about that. Uh, what can jab lock on Mario? Um, so at low percents, around 20% on most characters, the forward tilt, again, will provide you that ability to jab lock. Um, and at a little bit higher percents, sorry, I'm just styling right now. Uh, at higher percents, you can go for things like uh, fastball back air. Uh, I guess that wasn't high enough. Let's go like 50. Nope, there we go. Uh, fastball back air will provide jab block opportunities, um, and you can also go for Nair. Um, sometimes Nair is a little weird because it has two hitboxes, but if you get the strong hitbox, um, that'll also provide the ability to jab block. Uh, you can see me going for a lot of down tilts. That's generally the best option, unless again you're going for that kill, um, which is the jab one, jab two into uh, F smash like that. Um, again, I know that Redwood was saying you could do the jab one, wait jab one, and I do like doing that on some characters, but it's actually pretty reliable on Mario to just do jab one, jab two. You just have to make sure you don't input the third jab too quickly, uh, or the third attack too quickly, or you'll get the, uh, get over there. Yeah, the jab uh, input. Anyway, so that was pretty much it. Um, it's pretty useful, it's really cool for spike opportunities. Um, if you can get somebody with the down tilt, you can get a lot of really cool spikes. No, oh, that was too far. Here, let's try this. Oh, that wasn't true, but anyway, you get the idea. So yeah, that's pretty much it.